put those things, what they did it a long time ago. We still got it. Kids learn from that, you know, from mother and from grandmother, watching and learning and doing. I used to do that, learning from my mother. I'm Alison Milika Carroll. That's my name. I'm from Manavala. Long time ago, in our country, it used to be uh, desert flowers and lots of things growing, may, wiru, good food like kambrarpa. That's why we was thinking about putting it on a tank to show other peoples what the desert look like. Inside the tank, it's a copy of water. When the rain comes, everybody get happy, you know, and they know the water also full of water. When they're running to that water hole, they sing this song. That means we're swimming in the water. This song is from a long time, and it still gets singing this song. We used to go out and swim at the water holes, get the donkey and ride back home on the donkeys, you know. So we put it together, a desert, and the cuppy water inside, and the grass weaving. I was talking to other ladies, can we make a wana and show that wana to young people to make wana? That wana is for taking to get maku and to get chala onions. Maku is for city crops. This wana is very important for the old people. They use this wana for everything. We go to push and we get the wana and then we clean it. Everybody was making the wana and uh, the old ladies was talking to the young one about that wana. There's two. Wana for hunting and wana for culture, for Germanies, for Inma, like dancing with wana. Then we put this on it, walka. Walka means that this on the wana. We made that ceramic spears and we put wana and ceramic together. And that wana is important for us, I know, for the future, for our young people to take it, to carry out all those things from the past, to see it and to know that they still got it. They still got those things there in their home.